Once you get to building C, you're going to go inside and take your temperature. When you come into the building, you're going to walk up to this temperature scanner. You're going to stand in front of it and it will read your temperature. Remember your temperature so you can add it to your form when you enter the building. After you take your temperature, you're going to fill out your COVID-19 um, St. John of God screening form. Just remember that it is double-sided, so fill out both sides completely. And when you're finished, you're going to leave your pen in the used pen bucket and place your form on the table. And then if you need extra PPE, there is PPE located in Kathy's office. Now I'm going to show you how to welcome your family when they arrive at Building C. Hi, Teresa and Zach. Welcome. If you don't mind, I'll have you step up to the tablet to take your temperature. Great. Perfect. Thank you. And if you would follow me, we're going to go over here and do your health screening. Okay. So, Mom, what was your temperature when you came in today? 97.7. Perfect, thank you. And if you don't mind, we're gonna take exact temperature with our scanner gun, is that okay? Yes. Perfect. The rate is 98.3. And mom, I have some questions I'm going to ask you. This is just for our pre-visit checklist to make sure you know that you're feeling okay today and that Zach's feeling well to be here. Um, so I'm gonna start with you. Uh, do you have a temperature of 100.4 or higher today? No. Do you or anybody in your household have any signs of illness such as cough, shortness of breath, chills, hey, muscle hey, pain, sore throat, loss of taste or smell? No. Have you or any household members traveled to a state or country that has a mandated quarantine in place by the governor of New Jersey within 14 days prior to today? No. And are you or any of your members of your family under evaluation for COVID-19, for example, waiting for your results for your uh, confirmed test? No. And have you or any members of your family been diagnosed with COVID-19 and not yet cleared to discontinue isolation? No. Perfect. And then I'm also going to ask you those same questions for Zach. So does Zach have a temperature today of 100.4 or higher? No. Does Zach have any signs of illness such as cough, shortness of breath, chills, muscle pain, sore throat, or loss of taste or smell? No. Has um, Zach traveled to a state or country that has mandated quarantine in place by the governor of New Jersey within the 14 days prior to today? No. And is Zach waiting for a uh, result of the viral test to confirm infection? No. And then has Zach or um, anybody else in your family been diagnosed with COVID-19 and not yet cleared to discontinue isolation? No. Perfect. And if you don't mind, I'm just gonna have you sign right here for me. Great. And if you want to just put your pen here in the used pen bucket, that's perfect. Thank you so much. And if you'll follow me, we're going to go to the bathroom and wash our hands. And there's also a changing area there as well. So thank you for washing your hands. Um, this is the room that we're going to be using for our session today. We're going to try to maintain six feet social distance whenever possible. And just so you know, all the toys that we'll be using today will be cleaned and disinfected with a CDC approved cleaner. Thanks so much, Teresa. That was a great session. It was so nice to meet you and Zach, and I appreciate you traveling through to our center today.